Hello friends, we're at Dollar Tree and look at these super cute calendars. You have the elephant, you have the buffalo check that says blessed and grateful. You also have the unicorn and the llama. Again, these are absolutely perfect for gift giving. How cute are these? They also have these beautiful vases that would make great gifts as well. You have it in the teal, the pale pink, and the matte white. Absolutely gorgeous. And they're fully stocked again on the macaroon little trinket cases with the little heart. I already have them, so I will not be hauling them, but I just wanted to show you that yes, they are back. But I absolutely think those vases are really, really nice. And how neat are these? You have gather, home, and love with the twine and the bead. Only a dollar. Perfect for upcoming harvest or all year round. I think they're absolutely super cool. Then right here we have be our guest Wi-Fi password. And then you have the little where you can write it on the chalkboard. And then you also have it in white, the whitewash. Let's see. We have whitewash and then we have the natural. Wi Fi, sweet Wi Fi. Yes. <laughs> that is too cute. And this is really cute if you have like a bed and breakfast. That would be absolutely really nice to put out. All right, right here we do have Wild at Heart. Loving the matte white mm -hmm. and the matte black. And then we also have Enjoy the Ride. How cute with those bicycles. And Live What You Love. Again, cute for gifts or cute for your own home. For a dollar. You cannot beat these prices. And they do have a lot of these really cute sunflowers in different colors. You have the red, you have the purple, and I wanted to get the yellow, but there's only one yellow. And it looks like someone picked out the rest. So, but those are out as well. As long, And we also have the mesh. We have the sparkly yellow mesh. And you also have the sparkly pink tool. Well, I guess it's, yeah, glitter tool. And then you have the blue, you have the purple, and the purple is good for um, Halloween, in, in my opinion, in my opinion. And some people love to use like the neon green for Halloween, so that is pretty neat as well. They also have all of the birds and the monarch butterfly. And the birds are cool depending on what kind of harvest wreath you're going to be doing. And this is all of their mesh. So you can see they have a ton of mesh right now. It's just not in the colors that I'm looking for. Like they have purple and white. They have pink and white. And they have blue and white. And they have this, this is cool. That's a really nice color. Really nice color scheme right there. And then you have the 18 inch wreaths, the 14 inch, and the square wreaths as well. And you have a whole bunch of twine. Natural jute cord. This is new right here. Look at these flowers. And you have the blueberries and the lavender berries. Those are really nice. I wonder what these are called. This is harvest hydrangeas. Those are really beautiful. I have not seen those before here at Dollar Tree. They have this really nice big elf powder brush. Again, great for a stocking stuffer or making a beauty bag. This is a really nice size. And I have seen these at um, Ross or um, Marshalls and they are not a dollar. So this is definitely a good deal. And powder brushes are always way more expensive than like the regular eye brushes. So yeah, that's a definitely a nice find. And here we have the Freeman Purifying Grapefruit 2-pack sheet masks. Cute little stocking stuffer. Let me know if you tried these and how you like them. 
They also have the Fragrancia Clorox hand soap in spring. And bonus, 33% more, 10 fluid ounces by Clorox. I'm not sure if it's um, antibacterial, but that's a pretty good deal right there. Here we have Frog Togs Cooling Chili Mint Wrap. So I guess if you're hiking and you get hot, you can put this and it'll cool you down. Or maybe after a workout. That's pretty neat. I have not seen that before. Here we have more of the Freeman hair masks. Soothing jojoba oil. Nourishing cameo. Repairing honey. Not bad. Again, name brand. Here we have Garnier Frucose Color Vibrancy One Minute Hair Mask. Great name brand. That is pretty neato. And then we have the Rave, which I already hauled, but I just wanted to show it to you again because I think it's a great deal, especially to be able to find it here at Dollar Tree. And over here they have the Hair Gunk Ultimate Hold for only a dollar. I know that's popular for boys and girls. And here they have these really cute flower sack totes. You have this one that says good vibes only. This one says do small things with great love. And you're a peach. This reminds me of vintage soul. And let's see what this says. Oops. Oh, it just says cool vibes. So I think this is the, the three, but this is cute. You're a peach. Love it. It's a pretty good size reusable bag again pretty cool to give this as a gift you know put your little gifts in here and that way the person can reuse the tote bag and yeah let's see yeah I think these are the only three styles that I'm seeing oh wait 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 pugs and kisses <laughs> all right all you pug lovers go to Dollar Tree and get your get your tote or if you have friends that are pug lovers, Merry Christmas, that is cute, that is cute. If it said chows and kisses, I would be all over it. So yeah, definitely finding some new cool stuff. This, this, these items are new to me. I don't know if they're new per se, but new at my local Dollar Tree. Here are these six sport, no tearing, no damage, easy to remove rubber bands. That's always nice. I have not seen that before. Then you have 24 ponytail holders, and these are little, these are tiny. Those are really small. And you have all these cute headbands. You have the white, the teal, you have the pretty, it's kind of a peach pink, and then you have the white, and it, it has a little bit of glitter. So, pretty neat. And over here you have Scoonchi, four. You get four rubber bands, two in the pink and gray, and then two in the white and gray. And I finally found these, the Mio Vitamins, A, C, and D in a blueberry. Yay, I'm super excited. I have been looking for these. Vanilla chai tea. 20 tea bags that would be cute to stick in um, a really cute mug. We also have the blueberry and honey 20 tea bags, and then you get a hundred tea bags, all natural tea for a dollar. And look what I found the drumstick cereal. Yay! Classic vanilla, taste of the original Sunday cone cereal bowl. And then they have all of this cereal as well. Pretty cool. And here are more of those Harvest plastic tumblers that are coming out. So yeah, I guess this is part of 2020. And then I absolutely think three ramekins for a dollar is a really good price. So I want to show you that. And they also have this orange as well, which they're putting in with the Harvest. And you go over here and you have the red. And then you have the green and the orange. So those are all autumn colors as well. And they also have the Cool Whip for a dollar. That's pretty cool. It's the eight ounces. I've not seen that here before. 
more of the fab, which I absolutely love. As a matter of fact, I used some yesterday, yeah. And I totally recommend it in the Spring Magic. And for weddings or parties, they have these little arrows that say reception, cocktails, and gifts. And you could really use this for, I mean, it doesn't have to be for um, weddings. I mean, it could be for birthday parties, yeah. baby showers, anything really cute here we have by Crayola you do get art posters to paint you get two art posters and then you get this water paint and the brushes that is a pretty good deal they also have the Crayola washable glue glue sticks story dice creative classroom All, all of this right here is all Crayola. Thank you, Martha, for donating $1 to Operation Woohoo! Yep, everything right here is Crayola, so that's pretty cool. And let's see, right here you have marker and print pad, 25 pages. Reading, readiness, basic phonics. There's a lot of stuff here. If you're homeschooling or... Ooh, metallic crayons. These little cooking magazines, slow cooker and southern favorites. This is a cute little book. Moments for sisters, unforgettable memories from the bonds of love. Chicken soup for the soul, faith makes the difference. And here's like their crosswords and their crossword puzzles and their word searches. Pretty neat. And this, this Dollar Tree is semi-organized, I, I, I must say, it's pretty, pretty organized. And here are these cute little caddies to store school supplies. They have it in the light blue, the green, the mauve pink, and then you kind of have the hot pink right there. Here we have cosmetic bags, and this has, let's see, oh, Gemini, Taurus, astrological signs. And this one just has the planets, the stars, the half moon. Pretty cute. Up here is activity trays. And that's what that looks like. They have it in green and blue. And they have it in the hot pink. And then kind of, this is a mauve, I want to say. Here you have teaching tree. These are three piece storage trays for a dollar. Those are the different colors that they have. And then they have the book bins. Orange, lavender, green, blue, hot pink, pencil boxes. Organizer by Jot in the silver and black. Scented erasers, five of them. Sparkling strawberry, outrageous orange, amazing apple, blazing blueberry, groovy grape. That's pretty cute. Eight glue sticks for a dollar. Wow, that's awesome. Coming up here, you do get two pencil cases for a dollar. Let's see the different prints. I like that print, of course. And it comes with the teal bag. Let's see what else we can find. This one's colorful. Yay. Comes with a neon yellow bag. Design. Let me come down here. There's the design one. And it comes with the peach bag. <laughs> Girl vibes. And it comes with a hot pink bag. Those are real, that's a good deal. And Jot is a name brand, so you get two for a dollar. Not bad. And then you also get an eight pack of mechanical pencils with these three different designs. So they have a lot of really cool stuff for, um, for back to school. And they also have wax melts. These wax melts look pretty neat. Warm maple and blueberry pancakes. Ooh. And hot apple pie. Someone said that this brand is from um, Dollarama, I believe. 
or Family Dollar, one of those. And here we have these shadow boxes and the different prints. Some are tall, some are shorter. Really cute. And let's see, woof. Huh. I like the black and the white. That's really cute. Sparkle every day. I'm sure we've seen this stuff before, but I don't know. I just like to look at stuff. It's fun. Love me, love my pet. Absolutely. I love my dog. Yes, I do. I love my Arby. Best dog ever. And they still have, you know what? I still need to, where did I put these? I hauled these. I have to find these because I need to start. Yep, I, I'm so glad I saw this right now. I completely forgot that I hauled that. That's cute. Blessed and thankful. Good things are coming. Choose joy. And then good things are coming again. That blessed and thankful is really nice. Love the applique and the background with the green. That matches a lot of my decor right now. And down here we have these little miniature photo albums. You have a butterfly, you have the scallop, you have the teal. That's what that looks like. And you have like the mermaid print. Oh, not a mermaid print, but kind of a snake print. That's a cool color. And I don't want to mess anything up, but let's see what, all right, that's just, that's just a regular print. And that's just a, a hold on. Let me move this out of the way for you all, so you all can see what I'm looking at. There you go. That's what that little print looks like. And this is four by six. Again, cute presents. This is live for the moment. Faith, family, friends. That is really cute. Let's see what this is. Family is everything. Really, I mean, honestly, I can't believe that they sell this stuff for a dollar. You could totally give, you know, put any type of picture or let's say a really nice quote and give this to a friend. Maybe if, you know, they're going through a rough time, or a gift, or whatever. These are new. I have not seen these before. And then, of course, we have the whole Wi-Fi. And I just think that is the best deal with the charm and the bead and everything. They're super cute. Alright, let's see what else we can find. And, of course, those are adorable right there. Here they do have the felt rolls. They have red, a neon green, white, purple. They also have adhesive cork sheet. And they also have these, wow, this is a lot of popsicle sticks, 100. And then they have this little activity set, planter painter set. And they have the bead storage boxes. And they have it in red and blue and pink. All those pretty colors. And yeah. But I am not on the hunt for felt. I am looking for mesh. And I have not seen these here before. The Lysol, Lavender, and Atlantic Fresh. You get one for a dollar. That's pretty cool. I mean, we buy two at um, Walmart, and I don't know how much we spend, but this is my first time seeing these here. And here they have some of the sunflower items. Ooh, do I have some of the lemon? No, just the sunflower. All right, I'm actually gonna end it here, my friends. I hope you all enjoyed this Dollar Tree walkthrough. I was glad that we came because I was able to find some cool stuff. As always, my friends, I will see you later and have a great day or a great evening. Now, you have not checked out our Dollar Tree haul. It is a massive one. Definitely check it out. Thank you, everyone.
Hello friends, we do have a, another Dollar Tree haul, and so I decided to combine these two videos um, because I went to two different stores and I found really cool items, and um, yeah, I just decided, you know what, let's just make this a, um, a shop with me and a haul video because it's something which we rarely do. All right, we're gonna do cosmetics first. I found Gel Lip Balm by Wet n Wild, and this is a really dark color. Um, our first of its kind a gel lip balm is specifically formulated with vitamin E, avocado oil, and a gel complex. And let's see, to deliver innovation with the ultimate performance and comfort. So if this isn't like my color per se, but I thought, you know what, let's give it a try. I've never heard of a gel lipstick and it is a pretty dark color. As you can see, it is, um, the color is rule. So it is definitely a plum, but I thought that would be fun. And there was actually only one left. So picked up that and I lucked out and I found more hard candy. And this is Glow All The Way. This is a different, I believe this is a different bronzer than the one that I picked up. Uh, this is Tiki. Yep. So this is a little, this is a different one. And I only picked up one. They were fully stocked. And I'm not sure if, like I said, I did go to two Dollar Trees, but I only did one shop with me. So anyways, I'm not sure. I, I know what, at the Dollar Tree I did find hard candy. I just don't know what I found. And that's not all I found of the hard candy. All right, this I did stock up on because, wow, I am like so excited that I found this. I think I have like one more. I bought five of these. Um, and this is the hard candy. Let's see. Hard candy in light, which is perfect for me. And this is the Eye Brightening Concealer. Reduces puffiness, diffuses shadows, softens wrinkles, evens skin tones, eliminates dark circles, blurs lines, brightens, conceals, and lifts. And it is a brush applicator. So how awesome is that? And again, this is totally my color for my face. Um, I use this under my eyes and I also use it on my eyelid as a primer for my eyeshadow and it works wonders. So knowing that I love this, I did haul five of them. There was a ton of them. And again, um, when you're looking for hard candy, they should call it hard to find um, because this stuff does mix in. Not all of the packaging really pops or the the Dollar Tree will put it in some obscure place. Um, like for example, when I hauled all of those um, lip glosses, the box was just thrown. It wasn't even like in the display. So definitely, you know, go up and down the aisles and look for them and don't be afraid to ask either. Um, I almost bypassed this and honestly, out of everything that I've hauled from the hard candy, including that cute blush, which I regret not picking up more of, um, this has to be my most exciting purchase is this Sheer Envy Eye Brightener Concealer because like I said, I will be using it underneath my eyes and as a primer on my eyelid. So this was a really cool find. Another awesome find was look at Remington and Remington is a name brand. These were only a dollar a piece. 40 count, 40 count, yes. So these were the two different colors that they had and this is the white, pink and black and this is the white and the aqua blue and black. And I now I have 80 of these for $2. And again, uh, Remington makes all kinds of things. They make, um, hair dryers, they make flat irons, and so I couldn't believe it because at first I thought this was just a no-name, and then I saw, oh, this is Remington, and I saw how many there were, and I was like, you know what? At first I was just going to pick up one, and I said, why pick up one? Grab two, and that way I'm set because the one thing I noticed about these is if you have thick hair like I do, these things tend to break, so, you know... 
unfortunately that's just the way it goes and like I said I wear my hair up honestly I think I wear my hair down maybe once or twice a week and the rest of the time I wear it up so I'm constantly going through rubber bands all right that's not the only beauty product I found I really lucked out by finding this and I only picked up one oops sorry and I picked up the the Garnier Fructis color vibrancy treat one minute hair mask naturally 98% derived ingredients um this is 3.4 fluid ounces vegan formula biodegradable 94 94% biodegradable no silicones no parabens no artificial uh colorants so a lot of people were saying they either found this or they found the dry shampoo and i've been lucky that i found both so i'm really that's another thing i was going to tell you I love the Garnier dry shampoo, and I only hauled one. And I went to multiple, I mean, I didn't go to multiple nine, nine, um, 99 cent stores. I went to a couple of Dollar Trees, and they had them in stock. And if I would have known that I was going to like them so much, you know, I probably would have cleared the shelf, or at least bought six. Well, now they're all gone, and I'm like, but I like it. Oh, well, you lose you snooze, you lose. All right, I think this is it as far as beauty goes, but I'm pretty stoked, and the name of the game is to haul brand names for a dollar. And again, everything we're looking at would make awesome stocking stuffers or, um, you know, items to put in a beauty basket or a beauty bag. So we have hard candy, we have wet and wild, we have Garnier, and we have Remington. And I was also happy to find the LED candles. Granted, these are not the big ones, but I did pick up two in red and I was only able to find one in black. And of course the black I want for Halloween and then the red can be out for Christmas. Now, when I was going through these, a lot of the bottom part had detached. So make sure when you, you know, if you find them and you pick them up and if they feel like they're light, look underneath because half of the box was missing the bottom part. So as a matter of fact, I bet you, I wonder if this battery is already dead. See? Yep. Because people, see, I'm going to have to get a battery for that. That stinks because people just like turn stuff on, you know, and they don't turn it off. And yeah, I didn't even notice. So I'm gonna have to already place the battery on this. Let me just see. So yeah, learn from my mistakes because, well, it's not a mistake, just check. I didn't even check if they worked. That is so weird. None of them are working. Huh. All right. So I'm gonna have to find what batteries these use and replace them. And I thought, yeah, you see, these, these were all, I don't know, it's almost like if little children had gone and played with them and turned them all on, and now they don't work. <laughs> because I'm telling you, they were all messed up. But you know what, I'm not going to even trip. Um, it won't be hard. It shouldn't be hard to find the battery. Let me know if you guys have replaced the batteries on your, um, on these. Because, I mean, it gives me the number to the battery type, so I'm just going to get it. If not, I'll just use it for decoration, but I really would like it if it worked. It says 120 total hours. So, I mean, that's a lot of hours. So, yeah, I'm definitely going to try and find the battery. All right, I'm still happy that I found these because it is far hard to find LED candles at Dollar Tree. They do sell out really quick. And I also hauled more of the garland because I didn't realize that they had an all deep red. And I really, really like this deep red because it can be used for um, harvest and for Christmas. And then I also was lucky enough to find um, another one of the green and white. So now I have two of the green and whites and um, I have the deep red. So now I think there's like four different colors, styles rather, of this garland and I'm pretty sure I have them all. So I have two of these, two of these, and then like two of the other two. So I have like I think about um, eight 
And yeah, so I was really happy because like I said, I had not seen um, the all deep red before. And this was the last one on the shelf. I guess the green and white is really popular because again, both of these can be used for harvest or for Christmas. So I just don't know how I'm gonna use them yet. But um, these seem to go flying off the shelves really quickly. So definitely don't hesitate you know, to get them if you like them when you see them because chances of them being there when you return are close to zero. All right, and back to beauty really quick. I totally forgot. I did haul this e.l.f. Um, powder brush because like I said, um, when you do watch the Dollar Tree walkthrough, I couldn't believe that they still had these. And this is definitely a good deal. Um, if you go to CVS, they have these e.l.f. brushes and they are not a dollar. I mean, they're selling them for something like ridiculous. I think it was like $7.99. So to be able to get it for a dollar is absolutely awesome. They did have um, probably about like 10 or uh, about a dozen, I would think. Um, I can't remember, but... Again, this would be another really cute stocking stuffer if you have teenage um, teenage girls or your girlfriends or, you know, teenage boys that like to play around with makeup and so forth. And who doesn't like makeup brushes, especially if you use makeup like, like I do. And I'm always needing more brushes. So, um, yeah, I mean, elf brushes are pretty cool. So that was another nice find. So I forgot about that. So that goes with my beauty products. And then I couldn't remember if I picked up a purple mesh. So I just picked up this one and it is just the regular six inch by four um, because this is Halloween and I am on the hunt for Halloween orange, um, Halloween green and black. And I'm hoping to find the 21 inch rolls. But if not, you know, that that's okay because I lucked out, you know, I was really fortunate enough to find what I found and those autumn colors are absolutely gorgeous. As, as a matter of fact, I'm looking at the rolls right now and it, I am, I'm honestly happier that I found the autumn rolls than I am for the Halloween because the autumn, the, the harvest wreath that I'm going to make is going to be up a lot longer than the Halloween one, I think. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. I, I'm, I'm not really, I don't know. I might put them up at the same time. I think I'm going to put the harvest one on my door, on my front door and the Halloween one inside the house. So that is my plan as of right now. So I did grab another one of the purple mesh. All right. So I did end up taking back those other pumpkins. And if you saw that video, you'll know what it what it ended up spelling out, which I totally did not mean. And I think you guys could all tell by the surprise in my voice on the video that I was like totally shocked and embarrassed. But hey, stuff happens, you know? All right, so I went back and I ended up getting a J in the natural, an M in the orange, and an S in the orange, and then I got a, C, and then I did purchase a C. Now these I'm gonna be shipping off to my sister and I only have the C one until I can find other initials. I'm not, I'm staying far away from A. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> so anyways, I did go back and return them. And then I also returned that extra teal. And this is the one I wanted. I wanted the black with the gold glitter. And I love how it has like the wheat. I don't know if that's supposed to be brooms or wheat, but gather with grateful hearts. So now I have the teal one and the black one. And that is what I had originally wanted. I did not want to haul two of the teal. All right. And while I was there returning things, I picked up the little hay bales because as you all know, I have that cute little red truck and I want to put this in the back of it for harvest. I'm not quite sure what I should put in the back of it for Halloween. Let me know um, what I should do for Halloween because I don't know. Maybe they have like Halloween scatter that I can put in the back because right now it still has the 4th of July scatter. Um, all my 4th of July stuff is going to be up until September um, after Labor Day. But if you guys have any idea of what I should throw in the back 
for Halloween in the red truck, let me know. But this is going to go in the back for harvest. So I did grab two of these. And again, this is another item that goes really quickly. So you definitely want to jump on it if um, you want to use these for any of your harvest displays. All right, let's keep going because I really found a lot of stuff on my wish list. And I have been on the hunt for these. And these are the On The Go Sticks um, Mio Vitamins or MI Zero Vitamins. Anyways, vitamins A, C, and D from real fruits and vegetables. And I lucked out and I found blueberry. So I was really happy. It's a drink mix. You get five of the pixie sticks and it is 60 calories. So I only picked up one because... Ooh, they have caffeine-free strawberry pineapple. That would be good. Or mango pineapple or mixed berry. Um, you know what? I would really want to find the strawberry pineapple or the mango pineapple. But anyways, I'm glad I got blueberry. I'm glad I found it at all. Expiration date is February 24th, 2021. And then I was also able to find the drumstick um, cereal. And it says, ice cream flavored scoops, the taste of the original Sunday cone, now in your cereal, cocoa nuggets, and cone cereal pieces. And it is classic vanilla. And expiration date is January 12th, 2021. And this is 10.6 ounces. I feel like I'm doing a 99 cent store haul. All right. Um, I also picked up a another food item. And this looked really good. And this is the savory check mix. Chex Mix Snack Mix, that's a tongue twister, naturally and artificially flavored, you know, it's not anything um, healthy, but this is in the cheddar, and we do like the cheddar, so I thought, why not, and that's a lot, that's, there's very little air in there, so I thought this was a good deal, this is 8.75 ounces, and they also had the honey barbecue, or honey sweet, something else, you'll, You'll see it on our Instagram. April 2nd, 2021 is the expiration date. And again, I mean, these expiration dates are so different than what we get at the 99 cent store. So I'm really happy. I mean, nothing has been expired. <laughs> I haven't hauled anything from Dollar Tree that's been expired. So yeah, definitely happy with uh, these little food finds. And I'm not sure if this is new or old to Dollar Tree. And I honestly, I don't care. I really like it. Um, I like the fact that it says gather and it has green and it has the distressed white. This is going to, this matches my decor a lot because I have a lot of green. Um, I hauled a lot of um, wall decor from Joann's that had a lot of this color green so anything that matches it i am happy to find i'm not sure where i'm going to put this sh uh, shadow box yet but i will definitely find a place and again definitely i'm liking this applique and i think for the harvest season gather it, it it's a great deal this is a really good deal and this would also make for a really cute gift as well Another item that I was happy to find is this calendar. I did not think I was going to be able to find it, especially in the um, black and white buffalo check, blessed and grateful. How cute is this for a dollar? And again, these would make for great Christmas presents. Um, I really hope you watch the shop with me before this because... I show all of the designs. I think it's all the designs. Let me know in the comment section. But these make for really cute little um, gifts. I mean, both of these. I mean, absolutely adorable. Farmhouse, totally cute. And that's not all I purchased. I really lucked out. I'm so happy with what I found. And I'm going to show you right now. I fell in love with these little houses that say gather, home, and love. I think they're too cute. Definitely am digging the appliques. I love the twine and I love the little bead and you cannot beat the price. I mean, they're a dollar each. Granted, yes, they are made out of MDF, but seriously, like, I don't care. Um, it would take more time and money, you know, to, to make this as a DIY than to just go and purchase it. So I was really happy that I ran into these and 
I know people have already hauled these, but these are new to my do my local Dollar Tree, and I did pick them all up. I really liked each one, and so I couldn't decide which one I wanted. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to get my glue gun, and I'm going to put, I'm going to glue them all together. And I'm not sure exactly, I don't know, I kind of like how it looks right there. Live what you love, wild at heart, enjoy the ride. I don't know. I'm going to def, I, I think I want the white and the black in the middle though. And like I said, I'm going to whip out my glue gun and I'm going to make it a three tier sign. And, um, I don't know. I might put it in, no, I don't think I'm going to put it in my foyer, but anyways, that's what I'm going to do. Maybe I'll find a way I can get a shark hook and maybe hang it on the wall. But yeah, that is my plan for those. So really happy I found them. And then I decided to haul this cute tote. You're a peach. How cute is this? And it does have the handles inside. And again, I hope you watched, you know, the shop with me before this because they had all these really cute designs. And yeah. And again, this would make a totally cute gift bag. I mean, for example, um, let's say you wanted to give someone this gift bag and you wanted to stick all three of these in there. Well, these would fit in there and someone would be really happy because they would have a cute tote and they would have these cute um, table decor signs. Or in my case, I'm going to, you know, glue gun them together and they're going to hang up on the wall. So it just depends. And then also, I mean, if I wanted to, I'd probably have to take the twine off, but I could make this a three piece. I would just have to take the twine off, which I really don't want to do, but I'm sure I could figure out a way to put it back. So I could make this, you know, um, because there's a lot of times that we go to like Joann's and Michael's and they have hinges on these, or I could put hinges on these like they do at Joann's and then, then I would not have to take off the twine. So anyways, I'm just thinking out loud right now. All right, my friends, this is our Dollar Tree haul. As you know, lately we have been hitting Dollar Tree hardcore because lots of good stuff is coming out and it's only a dollar. And, um, you know, I must say that some of the stuff I like a lot better than at the 99. So, um, yeah, you know, I'm, I'm having a lot of fun and I hope you all enjoyed the shop with me and I hope you enjoyed our haul and let me know what you think what, what you think about it in the comments and let me know what you think I should do with the red truck for Halloween. All right, my friends, I'm going to go so that I can get this loaded up and I will see you all tomorrow. Who knows where we will be? Um I'm not feeling good today, which is why our Instagram is quiet. If our Instagram is quiet, that usually means I'm on vacation or I'm not feeling well. Today, um I'm not sick like how should I put it? It's a personal thing. <laughs> and, and, and if you're a woman, you'll know what I'm, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. Um, or if you're a man, I mean, it's no, you know, it's no big deal. But anyways, it's just a personal thing. And I just did not feel like going out anywhere. So um, anyways, tomorrow, though, I will be out and about and who knows where we will be at tomorrow. So I hope you all enjoyed these two videos combined and I will see you all later. As always, my friends, have a great day or a great evening and thank you so much for the support. I truly, truly appreciate it.